Hello everyone, uh, I just wanted to do a quick video on an update on our binomial and Poisson distributions. Uh, we have a little bit of better software now, uh, so we have to do less programming. So I just want to show you where we are right now. So if we go and look at our commander, rcmdr, oops, sorry, underneath our packages, What we have is we've got our base, our commander, our commander miscellaneous, and our plugin. And our plugin has gone through a recent update to 1.1.0. Uh, if you don't know or if you can't find this, you can always just click this update button and it'll pull up all the packages of yours that do need some updating. So it looks like that I've got two that need to be updated. All you have to do is just click your select all and click install updates. Um, and I've got some other things running in the background right now, but you just click like yes and okay, and you let it update the couple of packages that, that it needs to. Uh, okay, so what we can do uh, is once we have these uploaded, let's go look at how we do our binomial and our Poisson distributions. So let's go ahead, we go to basic statistics, and I'm gonna to go to our random variables, discrete distribution, and I'm gonna to go to my binomial, and I'm gonna to go to my binomial probabilities and we get this pop-up box. All right, so we still have like our number of trials and our probability of success. So I'm gonna do like five trials with a probability of success of 50%. So like I'm flipping a coin five times. And then there's this new box. It says show cumulative probabilities. If I click on this and I click apply, notice how it now produces the three columns of my probability table. It produces my support, my PMF, and my CDF. Previously, we didn't have this checkbox, and so we didn't have the option to see our CDF right away. But if you notice, the code in our R Commander window is a little bit different, and I think that's where we were having some probabilities, because in previous videos, I showed how we can manually go through and change our code uh, to do this exact same thing. So now, we don't have to do the extra coding. In order to get our CDF, all we have to do is click this button. Okay, and let's go ahead and take a look at this for our Poisson distributions. We can go basic statistics and go to our discretes, and Poisson and Poisson probabilities. Let's say we have a mean of three, and I once again click my show cumulative probabilities. I can click apply, and notice how it gives me my Poisson distribution, and it's given me my PMF and my CDF. So this is a great thing for you guys. This has actually made it so that there is less work for you. You don't have to mess around in this case with extra, um, with extra programming or anything. And that's that's about it. That's how we go and make our probability tables for Poisson and binomial, and it will automatically make your cumulative distribution functions. Uh, I hope that helps out, and I will see you guys later. Have a good one.